Happy Monday everyone. It is another gloomy day here in West Michigan. The cloud cover is going to continue throughout this evening and as we take a closer look towards Ravana and Grand Rapids, it's widespread cloud cover all across West Michigan. We are really seeing that cloud cover because of an approaching system that's expected to bring widespread rain showers, potentially even a few rumbles of thunder leading into your Tuesday. You're going to want your rain gear and your umbrella all day on Tuesday. Don't forget it as you're stepping out the front door tomorrow. As we take a look now at that system, there is some strength associated to this incoming system. And on top of it, there's also going to be quite a bit of rainfall that's associated with it. I know many of us, including my grandparents, very excited about the rain that's going to be coming in, that we're going to finally see some rain for our flowers, for our crops, something that we've been looking forward to. Now our winds currently, they are very steady from the west between five to about 10 miles per hour. And it is currently 52 degrees in Cassopolis, 51 in Hartford, and even 52 degrees in Fulton right now. 53 at the Kalamazoo Airport, 50 in Fenville, 50 degrees also in Hopkins, 49 in Sparta, 47 degrees at Norton Shores, 49 in Belding, and up towards Hersey, also about 50 degrees, 49 in Pentwater. So we're well below average for this time of year. The average high temperature for today is 65 degrees. So clearly we are below that. And throughout the rest of our evening, our temperatures will be dropping back to the upper 40s by 9 p.m., 47 degrees by 11 p.m., and by tonight, temperatures will be staying in the lower 40s. So we're not going to deal with that hard freeze for tonight. At least the temperatures will be warmer than that. But still expected to drop down to 44 degrees in Holland and 48 degrees in Kalamazoo with cloudy skies. Our future track shows the incoming system overnight starting to approach and move into West Michigan after midnight. Scattered rain showers becoming heavy by 830 in the morning and then gradually pushing towards the east. But that's not the end of the rain. We're still going to see scattered rain showers persist, continuing into the late afternoon and evening where we could have additional rumbles of thunder lining up, especially in southwest Michigan. Becoming dry Tuesday night and leading into some early morning cloud cover on Wednesday before we finally have mostly sunny skies throughout the rest of our Wednesday and temperatures will be getting warmer. No severe weather is in the forecast for Tuesday. All of the severe weather potential is actually going to be staying towards our south, expected to potentially see some stronger storms through Cincinnati and even southern Ohio, but luckily here in West Michigan, we're only going to run into a few rumbles of thunder. Our high temperature trend shows below average temperatures throughout this entire work week, but they're not going to be too bad. The lower 60s for Wednesday, Thursday and Friday, climbing temperatures throughout this weekend. Mother's Day, a perfect Mother's Day gift, a high temperature of 68 degrees, jumping to 73 on Monday with mostly sunny skies. Now our Super 7 Day Planner shows mostly sunny conditions throughout the rest of our Wednesday, becoming partly cloudy on Thursday as there will be a system moving in on Friday, a high temperature of 60 degrees, and that's what's going to give us our rain that's moving through, eventually leading into a drier Mother's Day weekend. The sunshine will be in full force for this weekend with overnight lows, mainly in the 40s. So far for the stretch that I've been seeing, no more snow back in the forecast, so that's something to look forward to. We'll detail more about your complete forecast coming up. That is. Hey,